Download the free plans for this project through the link in the description. The secret to this project is using a tongue and groove board for the bottom. They're inexpensive and so pretty. One of the tongue and groove boards needs to be cut in half so that you have a square edge on each of the ends. You can do this with a table saw or a circular saw as I'm doing in the video. Then assemble all of the tongue and groove boards. I recommend adding a little bit of glue at each joint just to keep everything together. Notice the ripped boards go on the end. From there we could just trim everything out with one by twos. I recommend a measure and cut to fit for the trim to get a perfect fit. I filled the nail holes with a wood filler and let that dry and then sanded everything with a medium grit sandpaper. I stained the tray with a stain called Sun Bleached by Verithane. And then I used some leftover hardware to create some handles. This is perfect for an ottoman or a coffee table tray. Check out the free plans through the link in the description.